All right, how about a little different action today over at Foxwoods? We've got a bar crest game called Shark Raving Mad with a little bonus game. It's a dollar slot, $5 max bet, and never played this before. And I'm actually gonna play a couple of others. There's one called Gimme 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 on the other side of this bank. I'm gonna try that too, because I say that every once in a while when I'm like, gimme more, gimme, gimme, gimme. So I thought that was kind of cool. And uh, a couple of others. And I guess Barcrest makes easy money, which is to my right, but I know easy money. Maybe we'll play that if we do well, but we shall see. Just gonna walk around and see what we can do and make some magic happen. Got a hundred bucks in there, so that's 20 spins at max bet, and hopefully it's gonna be nice. Three bonuses on the line is what we're looking for, or the two times wilds is gonna be awesome as well. Hopefully we got some sound in this newer looking game, and let's see what happens. Be nice, shark raving mad. Here we go. It's kind of a fast one there. Not on the pay line, but close. Handle doesn't work. Five line game, you know the drill. One, two, three, four, and five. Two times wild for two bucks. All right, let's see the bonus. Kind of reminds me of uh, Triple Diamond Deluxe with cheese. Moving around. bucks for that. Money back. All right, T's in bonus. Let's get the bonus. Let me know if you enjoy this action. I really don't play these games, but just curious if you guys do. If you got them in your local, big wins on it, favorite sessions, let's hear it. And don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Maybe that's what we need to get those bonuses on the line. That's all I ask and I greatly appreciate it as always. Come on, we got two more. All right, last one. Ooh, and we get one last max bet spin for the miracle. Nope, it didn't happen. What's there to cash out? Nothing. <laughs> I don't know why it's making that noise. It's just teasing you. Let's walk around to the other side. We're gonna try all three of these. And hopefully do a little easy money for dessert. As I said, gimme, gimme, a gimme. <laughs> all right, we got a bonus game. Three scatter, gimme, gimme, gimme's. We'll trigger the bonus game. What is the bonus game? I have no clue, but we'll find out together, hopefully. Now just get a hundred bucks in there and we'll be ready to rock and roll. All right, got some good sounds. Looks like this is all about the fruit. Watermelon being the highest symbol and a kiwi being, I don't know why it's not a lemon, <laughs> the lowest. All right, let's see if we can't fix that glare a little bit. Maybe go a little lower. Nah, that doesn't look good. Maybe a little higher. All right. Sorry about that glare. I gotta move my hands around. Well, let's get it going. Here we go. Let's be nice. Gimme, gimme, gimme. I 
I see a guineas. I'd like to hear a third chime. Cherries for four bucks. cherry. Wow. Need a little scotch tape in there. Seven bucks for the strawberries. spins left. Ouch. $99 loser. Not fun. <laughs> Not fun at all. All right. We're going to try this little guy here flipping out. Now, I have played this game once in Tampa. I think it was with Mom. And that looks pretty good. I'll leave it just like that. Kind of like a little imitation pinball, but not sure if Barcrest made pinball, I'm sure. Some of you know out there. Maybe this was their version after they merged with IGT or sold it to IGT. But let's see what happens. All right, we need three flipping outs on the pay line to get five shots. Let's see you be nice flipping out. We need a little redemption. We're down $199 and I'm not singing $99 a beer in the wall. <laughs> All right. Get down there. If this were the nine line pinball, it would have been nice. Nothing for the wild on this one. Not like the first one. Two times wilds. Cross the line. I'll make a thousand bucks. Oh, could have been right there. That would have made me a believer. Fall short, Barcrest. But you know what? I'd be happy with the line hit right now. Thank you. Do it again. Thank you, cherries. Let's get some flipping outs. We 
need you to show up, not the tease. Nine bucks. Oh, now you show up when you should have been there. Handle works. Cherry blocker. Thank you two times. Come on. Five more, come on. Handle all the way through. All right. Yowza. Come on. Oh, you, you. I'm going to throw in that dollar. Oh, we got a wager saver. You know what? Let's play the wager saver and we will lose. Terrible. I should have put in the dollar, but I didn't. Oh, well. All right. Looks like it's wild extra. Last up. I hope we're not going to realize why these machines are very quiet in the casino. <laughs> if this doesn't pan out with a nice win, we will learn the hard way. But let's give it a shot. And like I said, I hope you enjoy this little different action on these bar crest games. And let's see if Wild Extra can do something. All right, so one or two wild extras and a winning combination on the pay line is gonna award the bonus multiplier up top. So let's hope we can get that and make, let's call it 250 bucks. I'll take it. Damage control, here we go. Oh, and of course, no sound. Let's see if there's any sound. Well, I'm turning it all the way up. But it is silent. All right, so that's what we need. If it was there, we would have gotten a little bonus bonus. Money back. Thank you, bars. Maybe we'll get one bonus game on these games in four tries. Nice to see a wild extra. get a line hit with you. Not nice. We're going down quick. Four more. Three. Still three. Ouch, last spin miracle, please. Not even close, wow. Well, unfortunately guys, <laughs> this little uh, trial was an error as nothing to show for it except a dollar. 
$399 in the hole. Tall order for Bucks and Banter, but we shall see. And probably Bucks and Banter is coming up next. I thank you for your love and support of the old school slots. These, maybe not so much. But please, let me know in the comments if you do enjoy this action. I'll gladly play it again. So it was a little fun, but would have liked a feature or two. Even if it just gave me a little payback. But that's the way it goes sometimes. And I do appreciate your love and support. And more action to come real soon. Cheers, all. All right, guys, how about a little double, double diamond in a dollar version with 30 bucks in there from a downward angle looking up because there's a little bit of a glare over here in Foxwoods. It's bucks and banter time, guys. Today, you got a question from Raven. And Raven wants to know, what was the reason to jump to $25 or $100 slots when you used to play only $5 or $10 slots? Well, I always played, you know, everything really. Uh, sometimes a little more than others, but whether it's a dollar slot or a hundred dollar slot, obviously the five and ten dollar slots are more in my wheelhouse, but I always played a ooh, <laughs> uh, a hundred here, you know, a hundred in a twenty-five dollar slot and four spins. So it wasn't really a jump. It's just a little bit more often because I'm a little more confident, a little more budget friendly with the larger slots and sometimes I get lucky on those double slots so that's a very nice hit right there and we will take that because there you go 40 bucks <laughs> and we'll continue for a little uh, session here at Foxwoods and make bucks and banter obviously a profitable one so I thank you for your bucks and banter questions guys really uh, you know Helps me get to know you by the questions you ask of me, whether it's about slots, about life, whatever. And I do appreciate each and every question. Some questions don't get answered, but most do. And as always, I welcome them. So if you have a Bucks and Banter question, hashtag BB or put Bucks and Banter, and it might be answered in an upcoming video. And you know, 50 bucks is a nice number to stop at. So I think we'll do just that and cash it out and say thank you, Double Double Diamonds. You did me a solid, and I appreciate it. Cheers, all. Thank you so much for your love and support of Old School Slots.